please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hey now, it's your girl Shanita Nicole and welcome to Do Dream One if you're new. And if you're already a dreamer, welcome, welcome back y'all. Welcome back, welcome, welcome back y'all. Welcome back. <sighs> Today, tonight, this is my first video since I hit 10K subscribers and I hit my goal and I reached my goal. So I first want to say she believed she could, so she did. I am so excited, guys. I am going to go live and I'm going to be starting going live. I said I had to wait till I hit 10K to go live. That was my personal um, goal that I wanted to do. So now I can go live, y'all. I'm just trying to figure out which day, which time, all of that good stuff. So let me know what time is best for you. And I'll try. My schedule may not see fit for it. But you always can watch the replay. But I'm so excited. I love you guys. I thank y'all so much. I literally cannot believe that I hit 10K subscribers. I don't know why, but I really can't believe it. I really wanted to do it. And I really worked hard. But I did not know that I could do it, right? But I did. And I could not have done it without you guys. So thank you so much. I appreciate you so much. And I'm just so excited. Okay? Now let's get to the video. This video today, we're going to be, I'm going to be showing you how I'm doing the mom's house, right? This is a fad. It's been a fad since last year. You see this? I did this for my mother. And I put my name, Shanita DJ and Daniel. Those are her three children that she birthed. So she has a whole bunch of kids everywhere she always calling somebody her daughter her son but these are the three that she actually gave birth to so i did i made this for her and um i'm going to show you exactly how i did all of that hopefully i can get my mom to come in here because y'all see i'm not in my normal place i'm in my office i'm gonna see if madison can come in and i'm gonna see if my mom can come in for a second so let's see if they're gonna come in maddie you can't can see you. <laughs> okay one second <laughs> So, correction, I'm not in my normal place. I'm in my mother's office. Y'all know when I was in here doing the side below haul. So, my mom, I want her to come in really quickly. Come on over here. Then I'm, <laughs> this is my mom. <laughs> she looks more like my sister. I said, she's getting on my nerves looking younger than me. I can't deal with this. And then this is my daughter, Madison. Get down, son. You too tall on that thing. No, not that far. Well, anywho. So mom, get get down. So mom, did did you like your mom's house? I do. You like it? Yes, I do. So beautiful. Can you guys see it? <laughs> it is so lovely. I love it. I'm in love. <laughs> she is so These silly. are my two babies that I gave birth to. Three babies. Oh, I'm sorry. My three babies that I gave birth to. <laughs> who is you? Who is and you I two? have another son, Ajanae. We call him Nate. And then I have a bunch of spiritual children, but these are the ones that I had. Yes. Yes, she calls everybody her kids. And this not is my kids. I only got one. <laughs> I, just, I have a lot of spiritual children, but I, yeah. God bless me, but no. You don't? Yeah, I only have one. All right, y'all. So let me get into how I made this for my beautiful Bye -bye. mother. Come here, one more time. This is my mama. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day, Earl. Madison, get down for a second, baby. This is my mother. Mm. I love her. Oh, check out my nails. She does color street nails, y'all. <laughs> okay, get up, Madison. <laughs> and this is my baby, my one and only. <laughs> All right, let's get into the video. I had this towel, though. Come on, get down. Yeah, yeah. All right, y'all. Let's get into the video. Okay, so we know we're doing the mom house tutorial, so let's go ahead and get started. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and delete that. I have the rose we're going to be using already. I did get that from Images, so I got that from inside of Cricut, and I just searched rose, and then I got the one that I wanted, okay? So I have that one already. So what we're going to do is we are going to go ahead and type out mama. Okay. It's weird. We actually call our mom mama. Like uh, we really little kids. <laughs> we're not going to use this text though. I think I'm going to use. No, not this one. I think I'm going to use the. Which one is it? The Cricut Sands? 
think I want to use the Cricut Sands. That's the one that I want. Okay, so I got my towels from um, Lowe's. And my towels are 3 by 12 but really, they're like 2.75 in height by 11.75 in width. That's really what they are. So we're going to make this, because I am going to be putting like half of a rose on there. I do want to measure. And I think I want to make the mama to be 7 inches. And with so I'm gonna make I'm going to unlock it now I'm gonna make it seven inches and then I'm going to make the height because it's really 2.275 I'm going to make it two point four okay So I'll make it 2.4. So mine is going to be 7, um, 2.4 by 7. That's what mine is going to be. And then I do, still trying to see what I'm going to do for this. Uh, I may actually make Mama white. And then I may make our names pink. Or our names black and then pink. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm going to do black, pink, and white. Okay, because I was trying to figure out what I'm going to do. So, then I'm going to go ahead and put our names. So, my mother had, oh, so this font is Cricut Sands. And then for the name font, I'm going to be using I Love Glitter. You guys probably know this already. This is like the font for these words. So, I'm going to do Shanita because I am the oldest. And I'm going to go ahead and go to fonts. And I did get the I Love Glitter from the font. I'm excited to use the Christmas one. But I did get the I Love Glitter from the font. And then what you do here is for you to make the hearts, you do shift and you do underscore. If you want an open heart. And if you want a closed heart, you do shift and then the up and down line. You see that? It's just an up and down line. I'm using a Mac, so it's under the delete key. So that's what you use. That's what it is on a Mac. So I want the closed heart. So I'm going to put Shanita, shift that line, DJ, shift that line, Daniel. And that's how I want my hearts to be. I don't want it to be in the front and in the back because it's three children. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to, you could do it two ways. You can ungroup it and slide everything over. Or you could go up to the top where it says letter space. And let me save it. I'm going to save it as mom tiles. And then, so now we have everything saved. So now here, I'm going to go to, going to click on the R names and I'm going to go to letter space up at the top and then I'm going to decrease it. I could put the, the, um, the number I want in, but I don't know what it is yet because I don't want it to, I want it to get close, but I want to, I don't want it to get too close. So I'm waiting for this T and this I to connect. Because everything is looking fine, but that T and that I right there. So I'm going to do one more letter space. Okay, I could have ungrouped those, but I don't feel like it. Because you see how it's like kind of overlapping? So it's up to you. I'm going to leave it like that. But what I'm going to do now is I'm going to weld it. Okay, because I want it to cut as a continuous cut to cut evenly and not for it to chop each letter up. We don't want it to do that. Okay. So now I'm going to, so I think, like I said, I think I may do white for this. I may do black for our names, and then I may do pink for the flowers. So black, white, and pink. Let's see what I have here. Okay. So... I have it like this. 
think I'm gonna have our names just a little bit bigger. Okay, and then I'm going to put a rose. I'm going to do a rose, and I want it to be, so this is 2.4, so we definitely want the height to be 2.4. And then... I'm not going to put the whole rose on there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to slice it. Oops, not take the shape. So, this is 7 inches, so 8, 9, 10, 11. So, I'm going to make them 2 inches, the roses 2 inches on the side. Well, no, I'll do 1.5, just so it could be like a little bit of a space. So, we're going to do 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I'm trying to think about the inches. So, we're going to do 1.5. So, I want this to be... I'm going to put it together. I want this to be 1.5. So if I do it right directly in the middle, we're going to see. So we're going to slice that. Okay. And I'm going to put this on this side. It's 1.53. And this is 1.0. So I'm going to make it 1.5. And make this 1.5. Oh. I'm undoing it so that I can. One point, I'll do 1.4. 1.4 and this is going to be 1.4 as well and then let's just delete all of these and then let's see when we line it up it's 9.4 844. Four. Okay, so the thing is 11.75. So I can make these a little bit bigger. So this is why you always want to check to see, you know, what your sizes are, because I can make it bigger or I could just space these out more. You know what I'm saying? It all just depends on how I want to do it. Now it's 10.2. Okay, so we can make mama maybe. 8.5 8.5 she's still going to be 2.5 8.5 2.5 so now let's see what the images are so you can kind of see how it's going to look on your tile 11.344 so we can make it a little bit of a space I don't want to. I don't want to try it no more. <laughs> I don't want to keep playing with it, and then it's it doesn't work out well. So we're gonna do it like this, just to be safe. This is how we're gonna do it. All right. So now I'm going to go ahead and print these all out on my mat. All right, and I'm gonna put all the three colors on there. Make sure this one is welded. We don't. That should be fine anyway. Okay, everything is welded so it all cuts out. And then we're going to go to make it. And then 
we are going to go ahead go to these three dots and move the object so we're going to move this over okay then we're going to click on this those three dots at the top moved object to this one we're going to move this object to that one as well so we're going to cut them and you do not mirror okay so we're going to do the white the black and then the pink Okay, so you want to make sure that you're going to put the white between the one and the three, the black between the four and the six, and then the pink between the seven and the ten. Okay, so now we know how it's going to be cut out on our mat and meet me over at our table. Oh, wait, let me show you how I cut it. Okay, so I either use vinyl, regular vinyl, or I use premium vinyl so today i'm just going to use premium vinyl and more to go ahead and cut okay. it okay so we know we're going to use so this is a new mat put this in a safe place i know i want all of the vinyl i'll be using today is oracle 651 i'm actually going to put the links down below because all of these are in my storefront as well as I'll put the direct links for you guys. So you can go either way. So we're going to cut it with the scissors that way. Then we know the mama, as you can see, is from one to three. So we're going to put it from one to three. Take the good old exacto knife. And go just a little under three. Okay. Peel this off. And we could do to nine if you if we want. We're to ten to get all the excess off. Okay. And then we you know our names. I'm not gonna do black. I think I said I'll do purple. Purple looks prettier. This is gonna be from four. Our names are going to be from four to six. Okay, so do just a little bit. And then nine. So this 10, this is nine. Okay. Can y'all see me? Yeah, perfect. And y'all can see me. And then because this is all the exact same type of um, vinyl, we can all do it together with the same pressure. Make sure if you're doing it this way, it's all if it's all the same vinyl, it's fine. If it was like glitter, because I was going to do glitter, and I said, oh, I can't do glitter. I wouldn't want to do glitter with this, because with this, it may not cut right. So you want to just be mindful of that okay and this is gonna be i just did this freehand i didn't even know if this right to four so it's gonna be from seven to four seven to like ten okay i just guessed this i didn't know if this was gonna be right or not but it turned out right <laughs> I, I was playing i was playing games with that because i could have been off all right, so this is how, I hope you saw that last part. This is how um, you put it on the mat. And you see how it's set up here. I'm going to load it, let it cut it. Then we're going to get to it. Oh, I'm also going to use, I might try my transfer tape I got from Cricut. Y'all, look at all this I got from Cricut. I mean, not Cricut, <laughs> from um, the dollar store. Look at all of this. I got more. But I said, look at this stuff I found. Right after I did that other video, I found more stuff at the dollar store. 
So y'all yeah, know I'm going to do one on this. I didn't want to do the montage with it because I didn't know if it was going to work out right. Look at all this stuff. All right. So y'all yeah, know I'm going to do a video on that. Okay. So first, let's go ahead and clean off this because the towels, I'll see if I can find them on Lowe's website so you can see. Uh, get the exact information on there but the towels they do pick up the fingerprints so you want to get alcohol and then of course these because they don't leave lint and dust Wipe it up a little bit all right so we wipe it off make sure it's nice the substrate is nice and clean so everything can adhere like it needs to. Okay. All right. Now all the fingerprints and stuff are off. Now I'm either gonna use my transfer tape I always use, but I think I'm gonna try this one. This one I got from the Dollar Tree. Like I said, literally. The day after I did that other video, the cricket video, I went to the Dollar Tree and found all types of Dollar Tree gems. So I'm going to see if we could try to use this one. See how that goes. But first, let's go ahead and weed this. My friend. So you can y'all can see me and this oracle weed so good see that easy peasy lemon squeezy once again another one of my other hacks tree crafter square transfer tape we're gonna see how this goes okay i like it so far it's not too sticky we got our squeegee let's see how it lifted up You do everything in the diagonal. Okay, I took this off, but actually, I think I want to do the flowers first. So, I actually want to do the flowers first so that I can make sure they're going to be in the right area. So, can y'all see me? This is the transfer tape from the Dollar Tree. Okay, so I got mama. I gotta be careful with the mama. I'm gonna put this side on first. My squeegee. Remember, I got this one from Tech, tech Wrap. Come right off. And then we're gonna put this. This could go however we want it, right? This is Oracle 651. Oh yeah. I like this. Oh yeah, this is good. Oh yeah, this is good, y'all. And if there's any bubbles or anything, we could place it down. Okay, so we're gonna try to use this same one again. If not, we'll get some more. And it's not that much in here. It's only a dollar. But it's not that much in here. 
Okay. But I actually like it. I like it a lot, actually. Actually. Okay, on the All right. nice and sticky too oh that looks pretty already now i got the mama so now i can see where i want to place it oh come on don't get don't do it all right i guess that's where it's gonna be placed because I typically don't try to do it like this. <laughs> I try to do it from the middle, but this stuff is sticky. The dollar, the dollar Tree wasn't playing with us. This junk is sticky. Okay, so as soon as it touches it, it just made it. It just attached it so hard, I couldn't even lift it back up. So it's good, but I mean, I didn't. I wanted to scoot it over a little bit. See that? I wanted to scoot it over a little bit, but it won't let me lift it back up. <laughs> this is my first time ever doing these, and then we peel it diagonal. This is my first time ever doing a tile. So, y'all know I do everything the first time I'm here. It's cute, though. Ooh, and it ain't even like that many bubbles or nothing. It still look good. I may put a heart right there. Because I wanted to scoot it over some. So I think I'm going to put a heart right there. Yep. I'm going to put a heart right there. Because I didn't want it to be all the way over. I was trying to scoot it over, but it wouldn't let me. So I may or another piece of a flower. I think I'm going to put another piece of a flower. Alright. Where's my transport tank go for that? I done threw it on the floor. Lord, I was supposed to keep it. And I like this one, so I'm going to keep this one for the last part, too. I got to get some more of this. I didn't think I was going to like it like this. Honestly, I love it. And that's the truth. Dollar Tree transfer tape is good. I can't admit it. You probably could only use it like once, though. Oh, okay. Perfect. All this. Now let's see how it does. Can you see? I'm in the front. Cook. Good. Let's see how it does with the thin writing. Oh, we get it up on the first try. This is some good transfer tape. I'm tripping, y'all. was easy. I thought it was going to be harder than this. I am in love with this transfer tape. I got to get some more. And that's there we go. This is good. For my first time ever doing it and then doing it to the side. Y'all know when I do it on camera everything is to the side. <laughs> So I had to figure out how to get my camera to be like directly over me. But anywho, I don't know if I'm putting another, I, should I just leave it? Y'all know I couldn't leave it. Y'all know I had to add that heart. Y'all know I had to fill in that space. Now it's perfect. And this one is too big. 
but I'm not going to grab the other one because I got to go get Maddie. But that's, you know, you can set it up however you want. But it will be the small ones from the Dollar Tree. And I have some. I'm just not about to go get them. But that's a wrap. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe if you have any questions. And I mean, any questions, comments, or concerns, please holla at your girl. If you have not already, please make sure you join Queen Dreamers. We love it over there. I appreciate you guys. I love you guys. And y'all already know I love y'all. Y'all know that, right? Y'all know we hit that 10,000, right? I said that earlier, but I'm so excited. <laughs> but y'all be safe out there. You hear? Bye. And remember, the difference between a successful person and others is not a lack of strength, not a lack of knowledge, but rather a lack in will. Word to Vince Lombardi Jr. Thank you for your time. Please like, share, and subscribe. Bye.